A 68-year-old male presented with a hepatic artery aneurysm, located proximal to the hepatic artery bifurcation and distal to the left gastric and splenic arteries. Surgical interruption of blood flow to the aneurysm, resection of the thrombus, and reconstruction of the common hepatic artery was planned. The aorta will be dissected to expose an ideal site for a saphenous vein graft anastomosis, and the superior mesenteric artery will be dissected for the sake of control. Following a cholecystectomy, the common hepatic artery will be dissected and major branches identified. The saphenous vein graft will be anastomosed to the aorta and distal end clamped. Medial to the aneurysm, the LGA and splenic artery will be preserved, while the proximal common hepatic artery will be ligated with a vascular stapler. On the lateral side of the aneurysm, the GDA will be ligated, but not divided. Clamps are placed on the right and left hepatic arteries, and proximal to the bifurcation, the proper hepatic artery is divided with scissors. The aneurysm will be opened and the thrombus removed. The cut edge of the hepatic artery opening will be oversewn. The opening of the hepatic artery will be anastomosed to the graft completing the reconstruction.